I'm pretty for a black girl, but yet when I speak proper, I'm told I talk like a white one. I have impeccable sight despite my eyes being slanted as if I'm Asian. I mean, I enjoy a good egg roll, but who am I trying to appease? I mean, you see it. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Why, yes, child, I'm standing up, back straight, chin up, above the haters, and I'm only 5'2". But yet, my confidence helps me tower over you. Yet, I am more than the kinky curls on my head or the curves that attract some of the grimiest of men. Yes, this survivor still speaks despite the many people that have tried to break me. I suppose I now have childbearing hips since I've birthed my little king, but yet overall many forget that I'm simply just a queen. Let me not kid myself though. I have always been that queen. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder, which is why many times when you think my cup is half empty, I remind you that it is half full. Even on my bad days, it's the radiance that comes from my smile and the pep in my walk that makes those against me stare in awe. It's the way I fit in with my race and even your race that has you insecure. I have something that you want that stems from my blood, can't be erased, can't be surgically obtained. Baby, we just talking looks, but let me put you on game. The resume speaks for itself, but for those that are too blind to see, I am degreed with aspirations that must be accomplished because I have to provide for my seed. I am mama for sick and for poor, ma'am the moment I walk through the door. I wear many hats, but at the root of it all, I make sure I continue to rock my crown. I used to refer to it as simply black girl magic, but I stand out in any room and come to find out all the seas. Red, blue, even the dirty sea of green, but yet because my melanin opposes what you know to be superior, you become mean. Green with envy, while I too am green, but from the seeds that bloom within me, planted before I even officially came to be. I suppose that's why beauty is in the eye of the beholder and trust you don't need glasses to see the beauty that is me. Here he, here he. Behold, part one of discovering your five senses where I show you the truth behind being that queen. Although let's be real, you can never be me even after I gave you all the keys.